two-year-old Colts on the track for the Budget Car and Track Rental Series Final. Here they are. One is Oaks Enforcer on by Towering Oaks Farm. Mike Wilder drives. Two, Alexander the Great on by Claude Gendro Stable with Randy Tharps. Three, Gifted Jade on by Huber and Huber, Jamie Dunlap. Four, Hyperlink is on by the Paint Creek Farms with Ray Paver. Five, Sand on Fires on by Bill Sanders with Della S. Miller. Six, Strawberry Rain on by Dick and Joyce McClelland with Dave Hawk. Seven is out. Eight, Abs Inspiration is on by Charles Miller with Brad Henners. Post time, six minutes. Six minutes. And approaching the start. And they're off. Hyperlink from the center takes the lead with Oaks Enforcer second. Alexander the Great is third. Gifted Jade is fourth. Sand on fire fifth by two. Strawberry Rain and Abs Inspiration is last. But Hyperlink leads the way in the far turn. It's Hyperlink by a length and three quarters. Oaks Enforcer right there looking to move early. Then it's a gap of four lengths back. And we have Alexander the Great in third. Two and a half more. And it's Gifted Jade in fourth. Sand on fire. Strawberry Rain and Abs Inspiration. Hyperlink and Ray Paver lead to the quarter in 27 and one. Passing the stands for the first time, it's Hyperlink by a length and a half. With Oaks Enforcer right there in the pocket, second, three back. Alexander the Great tries to draw closer, third, and there goes Oaks Enforcer pulling the pocket on Hyperlink. Four lengths behind Alexander the Great, we come down to Gifted Jade, followed by Sand on Fire. Three back to Strawberry Rain, who's being called on for more. Abs Inspiration is last, they are well strung out. About 20 lengths cover the field of seven. They race around the turn on the way to the half. It's Oaks Enforcer leading the way. Hyperlink is off stride, and Alexander the Great moves into second, and he's charging up now. He's going to challenge for the top spot, but now Randy Tharps looks to maybe settle him back in there. But Gifted Jade drives through at the rail to be third. Halftime, 55 seconds flat down the back stretch. It's Oaks Enforcer by a length and a half with Alexander the Great in second. Sand on fire, left uncovered the outside with two to make up in third. And then we have Gifted Jada Snug fourth at the rail. Next to line is Strawberry Rain on the inside of Abs Inspiration who's starting to rally from the back of the pack. And Hyperlink is last, 125 and four. Around to the top of the stretch, it's Oaks Enforcer by a length and a half. Alexander the Great poised to strike from the pocket. Second, two and a half lengths further back to Gifted Jade in third. Abs Inspiration on the outside with five to make up as they bend off the turn and drive through the stretch. It's Oaks Enforcer on top by two. Alexander the Great is bearing down on the outside. Second, four lengths back to Abs Inspiration and Gifted Jade. Oaks Enforcer has something left though and Oaks Enforcer draws out to win it by a length and a half. Alexander the Great was second with Gifted Jade third. 154 and two. And the 11th race is now official. One, two, exact of $4.60. Try one, two, three, $17 even. Back to the winner's circle is number one, Oaks Enforcer, a two-year-old bay called by Pacific Rocket out of Yankee Del Rey by Beach Towel and by the Towering Oaks Farm in Manor, Ohio. Virgil Morgan Jr. trains Mike Wilder with a pair of wins this afternoon and the fifth win on the season for Oaks Enforcer, 154 and two. In the winner's circle, happy to make the trophy presentation. Chairman of the Ohio State Racing Commission, Mr. Luther Heckman.